is the, uh, you know, the big thing. Obviously, it was, uh, you know, it was great work against Cleveland. Both teams came in here trying to get better as a football team, and and uh, you know, so I thought that was really good. I was I was happy with that. Obviously, if you keep the score, I think it's probably one for the defense on both fields. Um, at least from my perspective, and, and uh, but again, that's not not to be you know that's probably not surprising. But uh, either way, it's great work. You know, uh, Cleveland's got a good offensive line, so it's great for our our defense to go against that that offensive line, and uh, just you know, good work overall. Had some terrible news happen. Obviously, I'm sure you guys saw Ty Powell got carted off. That's a possible ACL, and um, obviously that young man would be done for the year if that's the case. It is indeed the case. Uh, but that's just horrible news because that guy had been playing great for us and really coming into his own. Finally found a, a home, you know, an inside linebacker and, and obviously a key cog uh, in our special team. So he's gonna, that's going to be a great loss for us. Uh, and then we had, had some issues. We were down to two running backs, three or four wide receivers. And, um, you know, we had a couple guys go out with heat. So we had Hogan and Goodwin. Kind of go out with heat. They'll be back tomorrow. Uh, and then uh, Sammy had a, had tightness in, I guess, his glute. So uh, precautionary, obviously, gonna we're, we're holding him out. But that really stresses the other guys. And, and you can tell on the other field. We weren't running as fast as what we normally do over there. Uh, and then, um, you know, we're down to two running backs. So uh, Carlos Williams, we, we don't know the extent of what his injury is yet. Uh, but some of you know he, had, he went off to the hospital this morning. Uh, so we don't, once we find out, you guys will know. And then Bryce Brown, uh, you know, couldn't go today. So it was, you know, we threw in Thigpen as a running back. We put a tight end sometimes at running back. It was, you know, we tried to make the, you know, the best of it as we could. Uh, but with that, I, I, you know, look forward to tomorrow, hopefully, uh, you know, getting more guys out in the quality of, of, uh, of our practice will go up. Well, we don't know. I mean, it was just a thing. Woke up in the morning and, you know, felt a little something in the uh, uh, weightlifting in the afternoon, but, you know, it wasn't anything. But now, you know, he obviously had this, this thing where if you touch him, he's, you know, I mean, it's obviously he's in a lot of pain. Well, yeah, I would say that the defense won on both sides. But, again, I, I mean, until you really watch the tape, but just from my perspective. Um, but, you know, we'll see. I think, you know, beginning of the practice, I think it was probably a little better than at the end when guys were really dragging. Greg, how do you feel about Yeah, well, we're down to four guys. So, yeah, he's twos and threes now, uh, him and Tony Stewart. So, uh, you know, we're fortunate. He's, he's a, a, a smart player, obviously, from Stanford. Uh, you know, you get that, but he's got instincts, too, and, and he's got a chance, and he's going to have to step it up. There's no doubt. Yeah, I mean, we, me and Mike basically talked to him about that, and, and we had a little, a little fun at, uh, about something. But it was, um, you know, it's good. They, they clearly came here to work. There's no question, and, and they uh, they practice hard, so that's good. That's good for us because we we do the exact same. So I thought it was good work for both teams. No, I'm not. I'm not saying that. Rex, when you look at this, what happened with Mike's career, what strikes you about? I thought I, you know, I knew he'd get to this spot. There is no question. I, you know, uh, he just. I think his background, our backgrounds are very similar. Both our dads are legendary coaches. Uh, he's smart, knew the game extremely well, hardworking, and uh, dedicated and passionate. So I, I knew he'd get get this opportunity. You know, I was hoping he hired my son one day. I don't know if you're on the field or Brown. I never saw it. Is that is that Ron Powder what he said in the huddle the first Probably. <laughs> I'm sure I'll be blamed for it. I was not even on the field, <laughs> and I'm guilty. What are the uh, matchups? I mean, when you look on tape with these teams, is their offensive line and their defense 
Oh, that's great. I mean, the whole group's, you know, a bunch of pro bowlers on, on both sides. So, uh, as we said, you know, iron sharp, you know, sharpens uh, iron. And you get you go against the best, and that's one of the, the, the best offensive lines in the league and, and certainly against one of the best, if not the best, defensive line in the league. So when you get that kind of quality work, uh, you know, against each other, that, that can only help. You know, I'd never, I've never been a part of it before. You know, the nearest we had is we we're, uh, Petten and I were together in Baltimore. We used to go scrimmage against, had a little mini scrimmage and, and uh, some practice against the Redskins one day when Joe Gibbs was there. And we got a ton of work out of that as well. So that was really my experience with it. And then today was, was great. I think the key, though, is to make sure that, you know, you're with, you know, like-minded coaches, and I think that that's what makes this successful because both of us want to, you know, obviously we want to have the best teams we can, and, and we want to be, uh, we build our teams the same way, but we want them, uh, we want to get better, and I think that was that was the the overriding theme with with uh, with these practices. Your quarterback situation, is it help? You know, with different defensive backs and kind of hone it further, if you will. Oh, I think so, and you're seeing different looks, different coverages, and and things like that. So that that's always a big help, and and I think these days, you know, it, it does help your evaluation. You're not just going against the same guys, same coverages every day. Okay. Thank you. All right. Thanks, guys.